If you're thinking about maybe trying to put a uh, butterfly garden into your yard, you're going to need to have both host plants and nectar plants. Uh, some nice host plants to have. We've got a zizia here, uh, golden alexander. This is a host for the black swallowtail. We have some butterfly weed here. It's in the milkweed family that hosts your monarchs. Have a nice spice bush here. This host spice bush swallowtails. We have a pawpaw here, which is the host for the zebra swallowtail. So you have their food for their caterpillars to feed on. Now you want something for your butterflies to feed on, which would be some nice nectar plants. Uh, any type of Rebecca is nice. This happens to be Rebecca herta, a fall bloomer. When you're choosing your nectar plants for your butterfly garden, make sure you choose plants that will be blooming spring, summer, and fall so you'll have the full season of nectar available for the butterflies. Um, green coneflower is a nice plant to add in. This is kind of a late summer, early fall bloomer. Gets tall. Uh, nice seed source for goldfinches as well. Some other nice fall plants for nectar on your butterflies are asters. This happens to be a New England aster. Uh, sometimes double blooms. These bloomed a month or so ago and now they're putting their second set of blooms on right now. Uh, false aster, which are these Baltonias. Nice fall bloomer. Also will bloom in the summertime. And there's just a huge variety of nectar plants to choose from. So kind of mix it up, like I say, look at them and get things that gives you a good coverage throughout spring through fall and some host plants and you will have some happy butterflies in your yard.